Baseball greetings, Panther fans, from right here at the Hebrew Springs Sports Complex. It's Billy Smallwood coming to you live from the F.L. Davis Ace broadcast position where your Panthers take on the BB Badgers. We had some issues with the live stream earlier, so we're just now being able to come on the audio part. And the Badgers have a one to nothing lead here over your Panthers in the top of the third as Badger sends it way out to center field and... Xander Lindley out there, can't field the play, and he's going to get a triple out of it. As that's number 17, Sam Bless. The catcher for the Badgers gets a triple to start off the top of the third here for the Badgers. So that will bring up the designated hitter, number 14, Cy Bless, will come up for the Badgers now. Beautiful day here at the Hebrew Springs Sports Complex. Plenty of clouds in the sky, but there's also blue skies. The sun, the sun is behind the clouds over here to our to our right. So 1-0 count here to Bless. And he sends it out to Xander Lindley at center field. And I believe Lozo is going to end up bringing that one in from his left field position. But a but Sam Bless tags up from third. And he scores for the Badgers as it's a 2-0 lead now here for BB over your Panthers. Gage Buford is on the mound here for Heber Springs. As Reed Boyles, the third baseman, comes to bat for BB. That pitch is in there from, for a strike from Buford. 0-1 count here to Reed Boyles. Buford and Reed Boyles. Pitches in there from Buford for a ball. One on one count here to Boyles. One one pitches in there for a strike to Boyles. One and two count now here to the Badger third baseman here. Badgers lead at 2-0 here over your Panthers here from the Hebrew Springs Sports Complex. Here comes the 1-2 pitch from Buford, and the Boyles calls time. Bowles is ready now. He steps into the box. Buford gets the sign. Buford taking his time on the mound. Here comes the pitch. It's outside for a 2-2 count. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. Bull sends that one into foul territory, and Peyton feels it from the first base position for the second out. So now two outs here for the Badgers in the top of the third inning, leading 2-0 here over your Hebrew Springs Panthers. As the second baseman, pardon me, the first baseman, pardon me, Lucas Young is playing second base today. He's going to come to bat now for the Badgers.
we got a discussion here between the umpire and the BB head coach about the baseballs, and now Coach Bridges has brought the baseballs out to show that there's nothing wrong with them or that they're pretty much brand-new baseballs. So just a little little question over the baseballs here. We got it solved, and now we're ready to play here. As Lucas Young will step in for the Badgers, leading 2-0 here over your Hebrew Springs Panthers. Here comes the pitch from Buford. It's inside for a 1-0 count here. Two outs here in the top of the third inning. Badgers already pushed across a run here for a 2-0 lead. That pitch is in there for a strike from Buford. 1-1 count here to Lucas Young. That pitch is also in there for a strike. One and two count now here to the Badger second baseman. Young sends that one deep to left to Lozo, and he fields it no problem for the third out. As we head to the bottom of the third, the Badgers lead it 2-0 over your Panthers here from the Heber Springs Sports Complex. We want to give our boosters some mentions here. Thank, thank them for allowing us to bring the live stream to you. AOS Tree Service, First Electric Cooperative, Allen Furniture, Tina Sewell with Rock Mortgage Lending, Hook and Ladder Throwing Company, McKenzie Realty, Centennial Bank, First United Methodist Church, Tim Brewer Shelter Insurance, Carissa Clemens with U.S. Bank Home Mortgage, and Eagle Pest Management. We would like to thank all these Panther Baseball boosters for allowing us to bring, bring you today's live stream. So bottom of the third inning, Billy Smallwood coming to you live from the FL Davis ace broadcast position as Gage Buford steps in for the Panthers, and he chops one foul over to the Badger dugout. Uh, pardon me, the umpire says it hit him, so he will draw a walk here and head to first base. So now Easton, Easton Cusick will go out and courtesy run. For Gage Buford at first base. And John McBroom will step in for the Panthers here. Trailing 2-0 here to the Badgers in the bottom of the third inning. No outs here for the Panthers. So McBroom in here for the Panthers now with a 0-1 count here. O2 count now here to McBroom.
Here comes the pitch. It's low for a one and two count now here to McBroom. Mm -hmm. So two and two count now here to McBroom. Grant Holler throws in the pitch for a full count here. Holler on the mound today for the Badgers. Leading 2 nothing here over your Panthers here from the Heber Spring Sports Complex. Here comes the payoff pitch to McBroom. He chops that one foul behind and back to the screen. Oh, and Broom chops that one foul also and stays alive here. So 3-2 count here to McBroom as the payoff pitch from Holler. It's high as McBroom takes a walk. So now Panthers have runners at first and second. No outs here in the bottom of the third as Xander Lindley comes to the plate. The sun starting to shine out of the clouds here. at the sports complex in Heber Springs as number 29 here, that is Weston Warden, will go out and courtesy run for John McBroom. So runners on first and second here for Xander Lindley at the plate for Heber Springs. Haller on the mound for the Badgers. Lindley squares the bunt. Umpire says he goes and that's a strike for an 0-1 count. Haller gets the sign. Lindley squares to bunt again. He lays one down right in front of the catcher. Haller fields it and goes to third for the out. And he gets the lead runner at third as the Cusick tried to slide in there under the tag, but it was a force out there. So one out here for the Panthers as Cole Payton comes to the plate now. Panthers still trail 2-0 here to the Badgers. Runners on first and second. Haller gets the sign. He deals to Payton. That pitch is in there for a strike. 0-1 oh, count here to Payton. Haller gets the sign. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Peyton swings and misses for an 0-2 count. So 0-2 count here to Peyton. Haller gets the sign. He deals. That pitch is low for a 1-2 count now here to Peyton. Haller takes the sign. He deals. Peyton swings and shoots the chopper up to second base over to shortstop. He feels it at second. It feels over, throws over to first for the double play for the Badgers as they get the twin killing on the Panthers here. 
Panthers aren't able to draw to bring any runs across here as they still trail to the Badgers 2-0 here as we head to the top of the fourth inning. I want to give the rest of our boosters a mention here for thanking them for bringing us the live stream to you. Ed LaShawn of State Farm Insurance, Eagle Bank, Jet Fest Motor Brokers, Hopper Termite Pest Control, First National Bank, Sugarloaf Medical Clinic, Arkansas Vacation Rentals, Angie's Hideaway, Lakeview Pond, and Southridge Village Nursing and Rehab, Heber Springs. I want to thank all these boosters for allowing us to bring the live stream to you wherever you may tuning in you may be tuning in from. So we head to the top of the fourth inning. Panthers trail 2-0, and here comes Andrew Jolly as he takes a pitch in the dirt that chops at the plate and caroms back behind to the backstop for a 1-0 count here to Jolly. The first baseman for the Badgers. Badgers lead 2-0 here over your Panthers. No outs. 1-0 count. Here comes the pitch from Buford. It's in there for a 2-0 count. So two balls, no strikes here to Andrew Jolly for the Badgers. Buford gets the sign. He deals. Jolly sends that one a little chopper to Jones at first. He tries to field it, but just too slow of a, of a chopper there from Jolly for Jones to get there quick enough to field him and get him out at first. So Jolly, he'll get a fielder's choice there. So now runners on first for the Badgers, no outs here. And Chris Benton comes to the plate. That pitch is low to Benton for a 1-0 count. So 2-0 count here to Benton as the runner advances down to second. So here's the 2-0 pitch from Buford. Benton shoots that one to Jones at third. He fires over to Big Broom at first. Pardon me, that's Peyton over at first and they say that Benton is safe. So runners now at first and second here for the Badgers. No outs here in the top of the fourth inning here from the Heber Springs Sports Complex. And now the pitcher for the Badgers, Grant Haller, will come to the plate. Here comes the pitch from Buford. It's in the dirt for a ball. 1-0 count here. So 1-0 count here to Grant Holler. 
Pitch from Buford. Haller tries to bunt. He lays one down, and Peyton feels it at first. It gets it to Sneed. He's out. Good job by Peyton there, fielding that short bunt there from Grant Haller and firing over to Sneed at first, covering to get the first out here in the top of the fourth for the Badgers. So now runners at second and third here for BB as Austin Patrome comes to the plate now. Patrome playing in left field today. He takes a pitch in there for strike one for an 0-1 count. Here comes the 0-1 pitch from Buford. It's also in there for a strike. 0-2 count now here to Austin Patrome. O2 count here. Here comes Buford with the pitch, and Patron sends that one foul. And that pitch from Buford hits Patron in the back, and he'll draw a walk here. As that loads the bases here for the Badgers now with only one out. Leading 2 nothing here in the top of the fourth inning. And Ryan Bridges is going to come out and have a word with the Panthers here. So after the visit there from Ryan Bridges, Buford stays on the mound here for the Panthers as number 15, Caden Ward, the shortstop, comes to the plate with bases loaded here for the Badgers, leading 2-0 here over your Panthers. Here comes the pitch. It's in there for a strike. Oh, one count here to Caden Ward. Here comes the pitch from Buford. It's outside. One and one count now. Pitches in there for a ball. 2-1 count now here to Caden Ward. Three one count now here to Ward. Here comes the pitch. And he draws a walk here that draws in a run that walks in a run here for the Badgers. So it's a 3 nothing lead here for BB. As that brings Sam Bless back up to the plate now for the Badgers. Bases loaded here still for the Badgers leading 3 nothing here over your Panthers. Only one out here for the Badgers. The top of the fourth inning. Here comes the 0-1 pitch here from Buford. They say the umpire says it hits Bless. So another run is walked in for the Badgers. It's now 4-0 here. BB leads over your Panthers and Ryan Bridges... Looks like he's seen enough as he's going to change pitchers here.
So back to action here from the Hebrew Spring Sports Complex. Billy Smallwood coming to you live from the F.L. Davis Ace broadcast position. Wyatt Winchester is now on the mound.